Hello everyone. Today I will show you how to install a uh, Comac DHK, uh, some variant of the Comac uh, keyboard input method on Mac. So you can see here I already have it installed. Uh, you see I have a very special one here because you know uh, in Comac there are actually several variations uh, that differs from where the Z is, where the M is, where the D, H, this kind of key is. And it by default, uh, I mean, the Mac actually comes with a version of Comac and also a version of D, H, I think. But that's not the one I want to use, so it is kind of a pain to use the, the default one. But eventually I figure out there's a way to install all these different variations uh, from this from this side, so Comac mods mod DH. So the way you do it is you just, I mean, I will uh, share this in the description. So you just go to another page to download the code. So this is uh, the same repo. You just want to download all the code. So what you do is you go there and download the zip file. Okay, then you uh, after you download the zip file, I mean, you will get a zip. And then you can unzip it, and then on Mac, under Mac OS, there will be two files. They include uh, the various uh, variations of DH and DHK. And then what you want to do is uh, you put that into the library uh, folder. So if you press the uh, Alt, it will show up a library. Then you can go to is it keyboard, keyboard layouts, yeah, and then you just copy you, or you just drag those two files to here, comat and comat dh. Then after that, let's assume this one doesn't exist. You just go to open keyboard settings. Oh yeah, so it will actually show you how your current layout looks like. So you can see, I like to have the Z here uh, instead of somewhere in the middle and also I like the G and K to be here that's the variation I use so anyways so you can do add and then you can you can see th <laughs> there are many different Comac variations now and you can just install the one you want and you can scroll through them and see um, uh, how the layout is and pick the one you like. For example, you can see that here the M is next to G instead of K and the Z is here instead of here. Okay, that's how you do it. Uh, hope this is useful. Thanks for watching.